Oh. So random. We'll just go back down to Covenant rank two. Okay. Got a two game, uh, a, a two run uh, win streak. All right, so what do we got here? Oh, we got Digi and, or not, we got Umbra and. And Hellhorn? Yeah. We also have the Chaste. Okay. Space Prism, consume and get plus one on this floor. Um, Molting Imp and Gem Trove. Apply damage shield one to friendly units. Add three uncommon or rare morsel units to your hand. That's pretty good. It's four cost, but... Hey, what's up? Hey, how's it going? Liam? Let's see here. So, we can do Architect where summon plus two on this floor, so just gives you more room on, that, on the floor you're on, or the trample. I think since we're doing Hellhorn, we could probably get away with doing th that one, the Architect. But it's up to you. I mean, if you, if, if, if you want to have like a trample boy. <laughs> Dude, let's just get wild with it. <laughs> yeah, we have so much capacity. I'm just looking at encounter tables for Pokemon because I ordered all the Gen 5 games in Japanese yesterday and I wanted to figure out what I want to hunt first. Damn it, you're, I'm man on a mission. Why the uh, Japanese games? Okay, okay. Thorns. Yeah, they have thorns. So that dude's just gonna get healed. I mean, if you put the other trains around there, that guy should die, right? It's a lot cheaper. Mm -hmm. Can you speak Japanese? Or I guess just at least read, right? Yeah. Are you being conservative about what you put on that second floor because you want to have room to, pus to put to a bunch put of other stuff? Gotcha. <laughs> no, I just enjoy hunting. All right. Ton of energy next turn. We serve. And not really quite the uh, upgrades that we were hoping for. The eater is always the person in the front, right? Mm. Oh, and now he's dead. He was dead before. Oh shit. You know what I'm talking about when I'm saying hunting? Shiny hunting, I assume? The only hunting I know about. Mind Collapse. Deal 3x damage to the enemy unit. Slay and gain plus 2 energy. Nice. Packed Morsels. Add 3 uncommon or rare morsels to your hand. That's awesome. Or Immortal Trade. Applied Life Steal 3 and, and Ember Drain 200 for the unit. Um, Ember Drain. Drains your Ember. Or Stack, so... We lose two and then one. Hmm. I'm inclined to think just go like soup, like just a bunch of morsels. What's your uh, your favorite shiny? Uh, hmm. 
Ascension might be good to get. Yeah. Um, is it always a middle floor that has the the the, the space? Mm -hmm. Okay. Ascension might be nice. Who who? Yeah, Noctile's uh, uh, shiny is actually looks pretty good. The shinies are like super hit and miss. Some of them look like really cool, and then you some of them you have like Pikachu where it's just like a darker yellow. And you're like, this is stupid. It's like not. It's like a, it's like a worse yellow. Um, I'm trying to get a Hellhorn unit. Yeah. Horned Warrior or Steelworker. You ever see Sunkern shiny? Uh, I think so. Is that also just like a, a like kind of a bland recolor? Then we go Hellhorn. Multi strike. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Get multi strike and what else? Now he's a 6029. Oh my god. Um. Yeah, it's basically no difference. Like the shading is. Yeah, I'm looking at it right now and I actually can't tell that it's a shiny version of it. It's like, oh, here's the shiny sunkern. And it's like, that's just a sunkern to me. Yeah. <laughs> Makes no sense. That's crazy. It'd be funny if they got literal with it one time. I mean, Armor 10 doesn't seem like that big of a deal to us. Um, yeah, I want to see them get like really literal with it and have one just have a little gleam on it instead. So it's actually just shiny. Oh, we can get one. Right, we get another. Uh... What is. Uh, if you didn't play that, what does Purge do? You just removes it from your deck. Oh, okay. Almost forgot about that guy. Oh, yeah. It's so crazy looking at the other floor and you have, you have five. <laughs> Incredible. Hmm. Darn. Why didn't you go gem trove? Did you not have the energy for it? Yeah, I didn't have it. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, sweet. We already have such like a powerful deck. And Tumbra Assault deal three damage slay on Slay. Uh, add two uncommon or rare morsels into your hand. Perils of Production applied Rage two and Ember Drain two to a friendly unit. Gain two energy. Or deal three X damage to an enemy unit. Slay gain two. Unclap seems pretty good. Yeah, but I'd rather have the morsels honestly. Alrighty. Rage six. Or a name that gives rage. Hmm. 
I think Rage 6. We can make it cheaper, and then we won't have to worry about it being in a unit that just goes away after a while. The only thing, the only reason why I, I, I could see get, getting another imp. Oh, yeah, then we could put them on an endless or something like that. And just farm them. Yeah, endless, and if we come across a, um, a demon fiend. Crucible Collector, Gorge, gain one lifesteal. Morsel Maker, or Branded Warrior. I'm... I think Morsel Maker because we have such a big floor, it, it can actually make like super good use of them. All right. Hmm. So card removal and another unit, or upgrade one of our spells and higher health. Uh, I think we go right. Hmm. I mean, Brandon Warrior could probably snowball if. I mean, maybe. Yeah. I think maybe maybe pick Brandon Warrior if only because we can have him on one of the other floors. A penance yard. Okay. Really terrible sight. Ember Stasis. Playing a black card deals higher damage to front enemy units. Uh, when summoned, friendly units uh, get plus one attack for every black card in your deck. You already have dead weight, so it'd be yeah. two. Or when you play your first black card each turn, uh, restore five pyre health. Oh, this will give us three dead weights. Oh, oh it's four. Total. So we'll have four. So uh, when we each, is it each time we? No, it's just how many you have in your deck. Oh, so each each time we we uh summon a unit they'll have plus four attack yeah oh that seems pretty good i mean makes our deck way worse yeah we need to get some card removal for sure oh this is duplicate <laughs> mm -hmm. for some reason i thought it was removal i'm dumb um what, what, what do we duplicate morsel maker <laughs> or Duplicate like uh, packed morsels. Let's go with this. That way we can have two floors. Morseling up. Yeah. Or one floor. Yeah. Depending. Yeah, the big floor. Enemy units deal one damage. They die. Cool. Good thing we had that point in the house, dude. Jokes on you, I don't set up on that floor anyways. Be gone from a realm. So he'll be getting slaves off of whatever it is that survives. Yeah, I don't think anything's going to survive. He's not going to survive. Maybe we should have put him on the, on the bottom floor. Yeah. Hmm. 
Let's get crazy. This room has reached the unit limit on one of its sides. For that side, effects like ascend and descend will fail. The enemy side is full. Enemies moving up the train will bypass the room. Oh. So wait, you can no longer ascend past the limit now? Oh, because it's a unit number limit. Mm-hmm. Okay. Not unit size. Gotcha. Whoops. So you guys have to put these morsels on the top floor? You even have room? Um... Yeah, you can put one on the top floor. If you just played Molting Imp and then played a bunch of morsels on the bottom floor, he still like, dies. You put one in front of him. You could play packed morsels and just oh, but it consumes. I mean, you don't necessarily want to do that. Or you could. You get a really powerful Molten Imp. <laughs> Really powerful, 8-7. Yeah, so I think in the future, definitely prudent to... Put the other ones on the bottom floor? Yeah. If you kill them, do they get the uh, the benefit from Wow, it? that one putting him in front killed him. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> He's like, hiya, and they're like, <laughs> Okay, so reinforce. Consume double armor on a unit. Shroud spike. Kill a morsel unit. Trigger eaten and gorge abilities as if it had been eaten time, two times. Back. Oh, dude, it's so good. It's so good. Oh, we don't need another one of you. Well, dude, we could. <laughs> um, honestly, I think it's just a skip. Okay. I think maybe getting one light up serif, like just one, one uh, capacity to make the other floors a little bit more usable. So instead of being five, it'd be six. Well, yeah, but I can just play the enhancements on those. Right. I think energy might be better. Okay. We can also remove the consume on because do those cards consume? Yeah. Hmm. Think we want to go here? I mean, I mean we might have a chance to get a really good, like, uh, the other morsel guy. Like, there's, there's another unit or whatever it is. Cool morsel stuff. Get out of here. Get out of here. 
rage does not decay on friendly units. Or 25% chance to deal 5 damage when an enemy unit enters your train. I think rage yeah. uh, is like better. Morsel Master, that's the one. Yeah. There we go. I mean, I think we go with, with that one. So we can have the two Morsel guys and the Morsel Master. I'm not putting the two on there again. You have a thing of a limit of seven. That's true. Multi strike. Might have to set up on the bottom floor. Or the top floor. If we can't kill them at the bottom, then they're just going to go to the top. Hmm. Now you're not going to the top, are you? <laughs> what do those morsels do? Plus your health in the other one. Plus your attack. Okay, cool. Do we put him on the top floor again? can't fit that morsel maker on the top floor, can you? Oh, you can't. So that floor is basically done. You don't have to do anything. It's self-sustaining. Yeah. Top floor. minor Forever raged. Oh, no, never mind. space prism. Oh, 
Oh, it's only on Slay. Nah, we're winning. I don't want to mess with it. You can use that on your own people. Okay. To get a better... Grant plus four stacks of armor each time it is applied to friendly units. Okay. This is a little pointless. Excavation eruption. Deal 20 damage to a random enemy unit four times. Gain two energy or ember or whatever. Cannibalize. Sacrifice. Uh, add three random uncommon or rare morsels units to your hand. So you can sacrifice one morsel to get three. And then um, void binding. Apply... Damage shield 2, Rage 6, and Ember Drain 3. We'd lose 3, then 2, then 1. Of, of energy for, that turn, for the next few turns. Mm -hmm. But the Rage never goes away. Yeah. Our Trinket. I think Cannibalize is, seems pretty good. March of Shields, dude. We have that Trinket. Yeah. What does it do again? It gives you four stacks. Okay, so you'd actually be getting armor 18? No, I'd be getting armor 14. It's already... Oh, it's already... Because oh, it's usually 10. All right. Oh, wait. Oh. The, the other, other one, one was deal 5 and then... And then 24 armor. But this way we can kind of control... I think we definitely need to upgrade our spells. Yeah. And remove. So I'm thinking that uh, we m maybe could even remove just one of the Shade Splitter Morsel guys. Because the other one, the, the other Morsel cards we have are better. They do uncommon or rare, and these do common and uncommon. So we could shift the balance at least a little bit. Stack Stone. Two damage sealed. 28 damage. Or 28. <laughs> damage reduced. <laughs> yeah, that seems good. Yeah. Uh, we can reduce the cost of our gem card. But yeah. Um, oh yeah, that'll make the slay way more likely. Hold over. Okay, wait, 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 don't, yeah, let's just, let's just, there, there was one card that I thought we, we wanted for, oh, but this is spells, right, yeah, I get, yeah, martial shields, I think is probably pretty good. Hmm. Make Umbra Assault free? Or make Gem Trove just even that much cheaper? Because, like, how much more could you upgrade this card? Like, yeah, it only gets the double stack, and that's only the. And it's not, it's not consuming, so it'll just come back around and just be cheap. Yeah. No oh, shit. Plus six attack. Stealth eight. I hate stealth. Yeah. Uh, I think we just do a regular. Okay. You can send him right now. Him? I oh, know the, the 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 enemy. Yeah, but why would I do that? I guess it doesn't really matter. <laughs> Put 
more Smaker on the top floor. You'll get plus four attack, so you should be able to kill it. Or I could do the gem. And just... And then fireball it. Yeah, oh, no, no I can't no fireball it. Yeah. Damn. Now it's dead. Our morsel maker has seven damage. Or a morsel. Alright, let's, let's look at our morsels real quick. And, oh, no, yeah. Tr using trust spike right now would not be... Yeah, we're at zero energy. That was the card I was looking for before. Mm. But we need we need consume removal. You put him back. No, I guess I could have put him in the front. Oh, you just didn't want the morsels to go to him. Uh, yeah. Then I was just gonna shoot him. Oh, okay. Never mind. It's probably the better option. You definitely want to put the life still on the middle floor, um, just because you want to give it to the guy. Oh, you're gonna put him there. Cool. <laughs> no, I was, I was in my own head. Um, yeah, I should have put the life still down here. Um, you definitely need to put one. Never mind. He does 11 damage. Oh. Alright, so, so it's the best ones we can put on that floor. We definitely want damage shield. Yeah. And it's just health, 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 and then attack. So you definitely want the attack. Well, I'm just running and thinking maybe we should mill this. His stacks of True. Shit. We also have, like, a shit ton of armor. But I see what you're saying. Yeah, he only has two. And he's dead. Hell yeah. Ember Cash. Add three excavated member Ember cards to your discard pile. Gem Trove. Or plus one on this floor. Gain two, draw one. Yeah, sure. Battering ram. Deal three da and deal damage to front enemy equals four times the amount of armor. It might, might, it might be pretty good. Uh, send a unit and apply dazed. I like that card. Inferno piercing. Deal 100 damage to friendly and enemy units. I mean, Inferno actually would be pretty sick. On the to you is on the first floor. floor. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, but this like this seems consistent. If we get holdover on this or something. Yeah. Like
Like, I never see anybody, like, pick this card. I just think we have, a, like, I think we have a good use case for it, too. So, definitely. I mean, the other one's great. Okay, I also kind of just want to see that card get used. Trinket or upgrade spell, I guess. I don't want to upgrade spell, right? I know, but here we can get two trinkets. Okay. And we get money. Yeah, this is hard. We'll check the rest of the uh, areas. Trinket, Virgin of Steel, Health, Elven, this Duplicate. Hmm. spells hurt yeah it's tough really don't think we need another i don't know it's hard to it's hard get rid of shade splitter and maybe get rid of a torch all right you have no more shade splitters hold oh, over hold over Might be fun. <laughs> making it free would be good. Yeah, I mean, I think making it front free, it, it's, it's just not a card that we plan to be using like a ton. Yeah, it's super situational. Yeah. Well, the wings of light. Rages with rage. He rages with rage. He's an angry boy. And yeah, multi strike. I think here we can be a little bit more choosy. I'll just die up there. Yeah. We gotta wait until we get a beefier dude. Oh, it raged it again. Just to send that unit. <laughs> I wish you could. Yeah. Actually, do 10 and then 10. It's still not even gonna. Wait a second. Scroll down. How much health does your morsel, your, your morsel maker have? One. Your morsel maker. 10. 10. So if you put the molting uh, imp on, on that floor, it'll kill that other one that's doing six damage. Then you put the muscle maker down and it'll only do four damage to him. And then we'll be able to actually have him be on the thing and we could try to make that into a floor. All right, so we could put the branded warrior on the bottom floor and give him the marcher shields. I mean, that morsel will just stay in her hand, right? It doesn't, like, it'll just go into her. It'll come back around, right? Yeah. 
it's like gonna muddy up our hand. Yeah, I got you. This boy has sweep. Well, it doesn't matter where we put them. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. Using a torch on is like just kind of like slap him. Okay, wait, wait. Let's, let's just let's take a look at these. Which one of these do you think we could use the shroud spike on? Like, uh, also we need to do this. First. Yeah, yeah, we definitely need to do that first. And then Scroll down. What's the um, what's the the morsel on the bottom floor? What's he do? Oh, he just plus three attack. So he'll get six times three, so eighteen health out of that. Yeah, but we lose him because of this motherfucker and his and his goddamn sweep. Yeah. Do we still have another morsel maker? We don't have a morsel maker. We have a another dude that summons it. Well, yeah, the, yeah the, the maker, not the master. Yeah. I was hoping to get him this turn, but oh well. Yes. Maker. I mean, might as well cannibalize one of the guys in the CV. I don't know. I guess it doesn't really matter. <laughs>
Yo, 111 armor and damage shield. We didn't lose anyone <laughs> on that floor. Deal 30 times, uh, 30x damage to the front enemy unit. They maybe spike of the Hellhorn since the rage doesn't go away. Yeah, yeah. That'd be pretty good. I think we still want energy. I think we still have a slight issue with being able to play all the cards we want to play. Well, no, just so if we get those things on a turn, we'll have five times. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, upgrade units and trinket. Or the, the, the cavern, some money, and is that pyre health? No, this is oh, pyre that's pyre, health. Yeah, sorry, pyre health, and that's duplicate. This is duplicate. Yeah, oh, it's tough. You know, that trinket. Apply days to enemy units when they enter the pyre room. Your pyre gets uh, five attack, or is, it, is that negative five attack? Yeah. And then trans steward units. Oh, fuck. Well, we don't have those, so we... Yeah, I mean... Yeah. Pass. Upgrade with multi-strike. Upgrade unit with rage seven. That's just like giving it seven, uh, seven attack. Yeah. No, it's two. So it's like giving it 14 attack. The rage one? Mm-hmm. Uh -oh. Two damage per stack. Right. Shit. My man really needs some health. Could give him Battlestone. More damage. It's like the same. <laughs> I guess our, our Morsel Master just doesn't just die. Yeah. Sure. Is the uh, unit limit still seven, or now have you increased it past that? No, you can't. You can only have seven, period. Gotcha. I guess by giving him extra, it makes it so we don't have. We can more freely play our card that gives things somewhere else. We don't have to worry about it now. The other possibility well, yeah, is um, you now have the freedom where you could place him on the bottom floor now if you wanted to, and it would still be super good. You know? You have nothing to protect the Brandon Warrior. Yeah. Well, I have morsels. I think it's multi strike, though. Jesus. Oh, you could put Brenner Warrior down and then play Gem Trove. Because it'll give damage shield. Damage shield one. In fact, you could play Brenner Warrior, then Morsel Master, and then Gem Trove. And give them both damage shield. Oh, sorry, Mor uh, Morsel Maker. Ooh, Lifesteal. I still have to put one in. Oh, shit, I fucked it. Whoops. Yeah, he's still dead. He's still dead? Oh, because he didn't put one in front of him. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> no. Oh, no. Whoops. That's going to make things a little weird. 
now we kind of like, like, do we put our horn warrior on the bottom floor? No. Do we just let our morsel maker die? He's good. <laughs> He's fine. <laughs> it's just said we don't have another like big damage unit now. So is he just going to become like a morsel, like God? I don't know what he's planning on doing. <laughs> I don't know what his plans are. You could accelerate his growth into his true form by putting another morsel maker on the bottom. I think that's putting bad money after bad money. Yeah, it's probably true. Just that we have no other guys. You know what? You can just, like, let this be. And then... Use the, the the Inferno card on him. Oh, but they have damage shield. Yeah. No. God, this sucks. <laughs> I guess it is dead. Spell shield specifically. Oh, it's piercing. Oh, it is piercing. So good. Never mind. Everything's great. Oh, you can use the shroud. Yeah, no. Just trying to think on what. Guess we'll go attack. boss I'm not going to do anything He's dead, Matt. Yeah, but I got damage shield though. <laughs> uh, do you gotta go? Yeah, I gotta go here like in one minute. So I, I just want to see the boss get destroyed. Dude, even though we had some weird issues, it didn't matter. So good. All right, good luck. You're probably just gonna win. So. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs>
<laughs> the hell vent. Final boss.
him. Fire is going to take some damage. All right. There's a win, baby.
Nice. Okay. Well, thanks for hanging out, Liam. And uh, see you guys uh, next time. Peace.